by happenstance when you're fishing for, for the bass in, in relatively shallow water. I was pretty surprised by that. Uh, and then, you know, the, the, the neat thing for me was to find that uh, some of the walleye we brought up had big balls of, uh, of mayfly larvae in the back of the throat. So obviously the hatch is getting ready to start. So for all you fishermen out there, it may be a tough next couple of weeks as that mayfly hatch uh, finally goes. But, uh, you know, like you said, it was a good day out. It was a good day to get away from the ballpark, leave baseball alone for a while and enjoy a sport that I really, that I really love. Not that you don't love baseball, but another sport that you really love. That's where we're going with that, right? Absolutely. Okay. Maybe it'll be a great day here today if you guys pick up a victory. That's the Fishing Report brought to you by City Cats, not your average guiding service, Minkota Trolling Motors, Hummingbird Fish Finders, and Pro-Am Tackle, the best live bait in town. As always, thanks a lot, Tom. Happy Father's Day. Go get him today, brother. Thanks, Paul. Same to you. Tom Vaith, Gold Eyes hitting and first base coach, joining us from downstairs in the dugout as he does the dugout show with us on Sundays. We talk to Rick Forney for an hour on his show. We welcome you to the Winnipeg Insurance pregame show, Ride to the Ballpark on Father's Day, brought to you by Winnipeg Insurance. Proud sponsors of the Winnipeg Gold Eyes, helping you protect the things you love. Visit us on the web at winnipeginsurancebrokers.com or call us at 889 28 Seven zero. Well, the Gold Eyes come into this one atop the standings in the north by half a game on Fargo. They are tied with St. Paul at 15 and 13, and Quebec comes in at 17 and 9. And Quebec has a half game lead on Rockland, who lost last night. Quebec at 17 and 9. Rockland is 17 and 10. This is game 29 for the Gold Eyes. Very interesting that the Gold Eyes will have an opportunity to win this series here this afternoon if they were to win it would be their first interleague series victory it would also be their 1000th franchise win today so we'll keep our eyes for those two milestone prizes as well this afternoon we'll take a time out we come back we'll have a look at on the rubber the pitching matchup is next after these on the gold eyes radio network Cheers to the NSA slow pitch team whose uniforms are not uniform at all. Cheers to the times where more prep goes into playing after the game than playing in it. Cheers to the team who carries the cooler to the bench first and then maybe goes back to the van for the bats, balls, and gloves. Cheers from the Bud family, Budweiser, Bud Light, and Bud Light Lime. Proud sponsors of your Winnipeg Gold Eyes and every NSA slow pitch team in Winnipeg. Go get them. Knowledge is power. Get the power you need to succeed at CDI College. With relevant, focused career training for business, healthcare, art and design, legal, technology, and more. Learn more. Earn more. Get more out of life with a career you love, not just a job. Find your passion at cdicollege.ca. CDI College. We change lives through education. CDI. I. I love, love it, it and, and we, we will, will succeed. succeed. It's a quiet evening at the lake. You can hear the birds singing before bed. The gentle waves. It doesn't get any better than this. Unless... You add Archangel Fireworks to your night. Having a birthday? Amp it up with fireworks. Family reunion? Nothing says we missed you like a crackling peony exploding in the sky. Typical Wednesday? You guessed it. You need Archangel Fireworks. 104 Pemina Highway. Cambrian Credit Union members will never say things like, I just love paying service fees. My high mortgage rate is amazing. Of course I'll pay $1.50 to use this ATM. With Cambrian Credit Union's great rates and hassle-free services, our members know we have their best interest at heart. Save more of your money with refunded service fees from the Unfee and Cambrian Credit Union. Cambrian Credit Union, building strong financial foundations to make your dreams come true. You're listening to the pregame show with Paul Edmonds on your home of the Winnipeg Gold Eyes, TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. On the rubber, brought to you by Cal Tire, five convenient locations in the Capital Region where more than just tires, Cal Tire, true service. And we'll have a look at the pitching matchup here this afternoon. Game 29, Winnipeg at 15 and 13, Quebec at 17 and 9. And whoever wins this one today wins this series as we welcome you back to the Winnipeg Insurance pregame show 
ride to the ballpark. In the pitching matchup today, Matt Rush will throw out the first pitch. And the 30-year-old from Schenectady, New York, now residing in Winnipeg, will make a start for the Gold Eyes for the second time on this homestand. It will be his seventh. He's 4-2 with a 3.93 earned run average, 36 and two-thirds innings, 36 hits, 16 earned runs, 8 walks, 27 strikeouts. Gave up three home runs so far, and the opposition batting 255 against him. Matt's a right-hander, 5'10", 180, and he did get hit for nine earned runs on Tuesday night in that 11-0 loss to the Wichita Wingnuts. On the other side, Dustin Crenshaw will get the start, 6'5", 245 pounds. He's from Panola, California, and Dustin Crenshaw will make his fifth start, seventh appearance for Le Capitale. He's 4-1 with a 5.22 ERA, 29 and one-third innings, 37 hits, 17 earned runs, 4 walks, 17 strikeouts, 4 homers allowed, opposition hitting a lofty 3-0-1 against him. Quick timeout when we come back. We'll wrap things up on the Winnipeg Insurance pregame show right in the ballpark. We'll look at the standings in the American Association leading into this one today. We do that after these on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Win a diamond at the diamond. Presented by Free Jive Winnipeg and Bijou Jewelry. Pick up your special edition Free Jive paper at the Tuesday, July 2nd Gold Eyes game. Fill out the entry form and drop it in the ballot box for your chance to win a loose diamond worth more than twenty. $500. Free Jive Winnipeg. Online, on site, on the street. Delivered to hundreds of restaurants and thousands of inboxes every week. For advertising info, visit freejivewinnipeg.com. Brought to you by iTech LASIK, Boston Pizza, and Herzing College. Hi, I'm Denny from Denny's Whole Hog Barbecue. And I'm quarterback Buck Pierce. Hey guys, I'm having a big event and looking for a way to feed my group. Call Denny's Whole Hog Barbecue. We're looking after you with a full catering service. Or do it yourself, hog roast with suckle and pork. Tender beef, turkey, chicken, pork ribs, and more. No group is too big or too small. Plus, you can keep the leftovers. We'll even pack it up for you. Can't wait. Visit dannyswholehog.com or call 344-5675. And we'll bring the flavor. The Gold Eyes Field of Dreams Foundation supports children's charities in Manitoba. I'm Tony Fletcher, Foundation President, urging you to get involved with the Fillmore Riley Case for Kids program by pledging a dollar amount per Gold Eyes strikeout. Or show your support by picking up a Gold Eyes license plate from your local auto pack dealer. The foundation receives $30 from each one sold. Thanks to you, the Field of Dreams Foundation has donated more than $1.6 million to children's charities since 1995. In business, every day is an opportunity to ask, where do you go from here? You didn't succeed by doing only one thing well. At MNP, we look at the entire business picture so you can get the most from every aspect of your operation. Strategies to optimize performance while mitigating risk, reducing costs, and streamlining process will help ensure your business is always operating at its full potential. MNP, wherever business takes you. Learn more at mnp.ca. Now, back to the pregame show on your home of the Winnipeg Gold Eyes. TSN 1290. TSN1290.ca. Here's Paul Edmonds. The final segment of the Winnipeg Insurance pregame show, Rod of the Ballpark, brought to you by Winnipeg Insurance, 889 2870, Winnipeg Insurance Brokers.com, two locations, West Winnipeg and South Winnipeg. Let's have a look at the standings, tell you where people are at coming in to this one today. We do that. Cinnaboy Downs. It's called the Morning Line for exciting horse racing, gaming, and dining. Do the Downs. Free admission, free parking every day. Go to asdowns.com for more information this summer. Do the Downs. North Division, as I mentioned a couple of times, Winnipeg and St. Paul are tied atop with 15 and 13 records. Fargo a half a game back. They played one more game and as a result one more loss. They're 15 and 14 and just a half a game in arrears of the Gold Eyes and the Saints. St. Paul, well, it will be Winnipeg and St. Paul starting tomorrow night, so that's the first matchup between those two teams. That should be exciting. Sioux Falls is three and a half back of St. Paul and Winnipeg, so a tight North Division. Wichita leads by two and a half over Lincoln in the Central, and Laredo is in front by two games on Amarillo. Amarillo's won five straight, and they've got to 15 and 12 over the course of their first 27 games. So this is an interesting one for the Gold Eyes and for Quebec. Quebec is trying to hold off Rockland for first over in the Can-Am League, and the Gold Eyes would like to leave Winnipeg with a 4-2 record on this homestand. 
to start a three-game series in St. Paul tomorrow and maybe be no less than having a share of first in the North. While that's it for our pregame show, we'll pause for the anthem when we come back. Starting lineups, first pitch, Gold Eyes and Quebec Capitale, the finale of this three-game series here today on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. I'm Larry McIntosh. Did you know that peak of the market vegetables are grown in Manitoba? Well, they are. 100% Manitoba grown with no exceptions. Peak of the market's Manitoba family farms are all located within 100 miles of Winnipeg. Peak of the market, always local and proud of it. The very best from Manitoba. It's me. Peak of the market. Excuse me, it's my first day. Where's the copier? It's not a copier, it's a RICO! Okay. Since Mill Office Systems tailored a RICO document management solution to our office, we've all been a little sensitive about our RICO. The print quality's amazing. The training from Mill was first class. It's totally reliable, and we're saving money every month. So don't call it a copier. It's a RICO! RICO, the leading edge of business technology. Made easy by Mill Office Systems. Online at millnoffice.com. In the world of PowerSmart, small changes add up. Did you know cooking with small kitchen appliances like a toaster oven or an electric frying pan uses less energy than your oven or stove? Even boiling water with an electric kettle will save energy. And next time you're shopping for a new appliance, look for Energy Star appliances, as they can use 30 to 50% less energy. For more energy-saving solutions from Manitoba Hydro, log on to manitobapowersmart.ca. If your business, big or small, has excess waste and recycling piling up, let BFI Canada make your trash our business. Our customized pickup schedules make it easy. With commercial and industrial collection services, BFI Canada can help any business get organized. Want to make your business feel like new? Then call up the blue. Visit BFICanada.com to schedule your pickup date today. BFI Canada. A cleaner community, a greener environment. Home of the Winnipeg Gold Eyes. This is TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Now back to Paul Edmonds. Starting lineups brought to you by Lazy Boy Furniture Galleries at 1425 Ellis. Lazy Boy Furniture Galleries live life comfortably. Matt Rush getting the start for the Gold Eyes. He'll face a lineup that looks like this for Quebec. Jeff helps to lead it off at short. Jonathan Mallow batting second at third. Sebastian Boucher in center field hitting third. Rennie Lebret will be at first base here today after DH in the first two days, and he will be in the cleanup role. Josue Pelle will catch in bat fifth. Royce Consigli will be out in left batting sixth. Bottom three for Pat Scalabrini. Awesome Shaw out in right hitting seventh. The DH is Maxime Lefebvre batting eighth. And rounding out the lineup is the second baseman, Carlos Willoughby. He bats ninth. That lineup again is Helps, Malo Boucher, Lavrette, Pele, Consigli, Shaw, Lefebvre, and Willoughby. Glad to have you along. Settle in for this one. Gold eyes, red tops, white pants, all gray uniform today for Quebec. And Matt Rush will rock, kick, and fire. The first pitch is outside at 134 today. 34 minutes after 1 o'clock on Father's Day, and it's ball one. Jeff helps on base percentage has been pretty good this series. 1-0. Swung on and fell back to the screen. It's a ball and a strike. He is two for six with three walks is helps. And a left-handed batter. Again, our first pitch at 134 this afternoon. We do that for the Greenwood Inn and Suites. The 1-1 pitch. Swung on. Chopper right side off of first comes Harther. Fields that. Throws a strike overhand to Matt Rush at first base. Gets it there and Rush makes the catch and steps on the pillow for the out and helps is out number one. But usually you see a little bit more of an underhand or a little rainbow toss over there. Nope. Casey Harther fired it at Matt Rush. And they get the out and there's one away for Jonathan Mallow. By the way, you can make the Greenwood in and Sweets, your home base for all your combination dining and meeting needs in Winnipeg. Call toll-free today, 888-233-6730. First pitch is a slider down and away for ball one. First pitch at 134 today for the Greenwood Inn and Sweets. Good partners of the Gold Eyes. And the 1-0. 
Swung on, shot down that right field line. It's a fair ball. It went scooting by Arthur. No chance for him. Mallow rounds first, digs for second. The ball's in the corner. Mazzola will dig that out and fire it back in. Not before Jonathan Mallow has a one-out double. And Sebastian Boucher, the batter. Our home plate umpire today is Thomas Perko. He calls the balls and strikes. Mike O'Leary is over at first. He's the crew chief. And Michael Carroll is at third. And we've had these gentlemen for the last three games. Perko at home plate today. O'Leary at first. And Carroll is at third. And Rush will come set. First pitch to Boucher is inside. Ball one. Boucher three for five yesterday with three RBI and a run scored. Batting 310 coming in. Now this is game 19 with Quebec this year, so he hasn't been around for all of them. 1-0. Here's a change up on the outside edge for a strike, and it's one and one. Defensively for the gold eyes today, again in those red tops and white pants. Jordan Guy to the other half of the battery. Filling in today for Luis Allen, who is available to pinch hit off the bench late in the game if the Gold Eyes need him to. Rush comes set. The 1-1 pitch is a fastball that's wide, 2-1. Casey Harther at first. Nick Lyles at second. Nate Sampson at short. Amos Ramon is at third base. And then Phelan Lentini, Tyler Graham, and Josh Mazzola left to right in the outfield. The 2-1 pitch. Swung on. That's hit right side. That's going to get through. They're going to wave in Mallow up with the ball as Mazzola. Here comes his throw, and it on one hop will be late to the plate. And Boucher has an RBI single, and Quebec leads it 1-0. And the batter is Rennie Lebret. So Quebec opens up the scoring in the first inning, as they did last night. And that is a trend the Gold Eyes would like to reverse. But a lot of times the opposition has scored in the first inning on this homestand. Twice in this series. And for Wichita, all three games. Here's Rennie Lavrette with one in, one on, and one out. Rush will come set. First pitch is inside, ball one. And again, guy to catching, Harther at first base, Lyles at second, Sampson at short, Ramon at third, Lentini, Graham, and Mazzola left to right in the outfield. Game 29 today, it's overcast here in the city. It was sunny this morning when we got here. 1-0, runner on the move, breaking ball in there for a strike, throw down to second, is right on the money. And Sebastian Boucher gets caught stealing for the second time this season. It goes 2-4, and there's two away. Real good throw from Jordan Guida. In fact, Nick Lyles was there waiting to apply a tag on Boucher. And the count, one and one. One ball, one strike. And the pitch. Swing and a miss in that fastball, and it's one and two to Lebret. One and two to Rennie Lebret. Three for seven, two walks in the series. Batting 277. One two pitch is a little bit low, two and two. Two and two. LeBret does not have a home run this year. He's driven in 12. Now the pitch from Rush. Slider swung on, bounced out towards short. Running pick up there from Sampson. High throw pulled down by Arthur. Looked easier than it was. And the gold eyes retire Quebec in the top of the first. One run, two hits, and nobody left. At the end of the half, Quebec won. Winnipeg coming to bat when we return to downtown Winnipeg on the Gold Eyes Radio Network.
and teamwork wins ball games, and it's made Saper Agencies an even stronger player in the insurance business. Recently, Saper Agencies teamed up with Canada's largest personal property insurance company, Intact Insurance. So now, when life throws you a curveball, they'll get you back in the game faster than ever. Are you over 50 with no claims for three years? Then you could score big league savings on home insurance, including no deductible on your first claim. Call Saper Agencies for details. 694-6787. Like it? Love it! South Beach Casino and Resort is taking surf and turf to a whole new level. Start with surf on Thursday nights. Get ready for a taste of the sea with Manitoba's finest seafood feast buffet. Just $19.95. Grab a seat at Mango's Restaurant and dig in. On to turf. Saturday night, it's all about the prime rib. Enjoy this mouth-watering buffet for just $19.95. Don't miss this surf and turf adventure at South Beach Casino and Resort. For details, visit southbeachcasino.ca. Dads aren't complicated. They like food, they like cars, and they like spending quality time with their kids. And this weekend, the Pony Corral can help you out with all of those. Celebrate Father's Day with all your friends at the Pony. Delicious breakfast, lunch, and dinner menus will have Dad's mouth watering. And then make sure to stick around for the hottest rides in the city with the Sunday Night Cruise Car Show at the Pony on Grant. Show Dad a great time this Father's Day with the Pony Corral. Proudly celebrating 25 years. Bottom of the first inning, we welcome you back. My name is Paul Edmonds. Glad to have you along. Tim Debenham is our producer and operator back at our flagship station, TSN 1290 in South Winnipeg. And Riley Lechuk, working the weekend, operating on CJ Radio out of Swan River. Brendan McGranahan is helping us out here, and well, the Gold Eyes need a little help. They're down one nothing. After a half inning, and for them, Tyler Graham, Amos Ramon, Josh Mazzola. After that, it's Arthur Davis, the DH, Lentini, then Nate Sampson, Nick Miles, and Jordan Guida. To face right-hander Dustin Crenshaw, all six foot five, 245 pounds of right-hander. Tyler Graham, two for five, a run scored in the stolen base last night. First pitch is low, ball one. He has hit safely in every game as a gold eye, and this is game six, so he's got a five-gamer going on. Was one of our guests yesterday and around the association, the 1-0. He's in there for a strike, and it's one and one. And as a gold eye, he is eight for 22. Hitting 363. One one. Swung on, bounced left side foul. And overall, in his time with Fargo and the Gold Eyes, now batting 289. A homer and four driven in. One and two. The pitch. Swung on, bounce left side, foul. Still a ball and two strikes. Defensively for Quebec today, in that all gray uniform, top and pin, Josue Pelly. Is the other half of the battery. Rennie Lebret is at first, one, two. Swung on, ground ball out towards short. Up with it there is helped, throws to first. And there's one away. And Amos Ramon, the batter. Carlos Willoughby is at second. The aforementioned shortstop is Jeff Helps and Jonathan Mala at third base. Then Royce Consigli. Sebastian Boucher, Asif Shaw, left to right in the outfield. And Amos Ramon, the batter, on a 10-game hitting streak. First pitch is low and inside, ball one. Here in the city, it is cloudy and 19 degrees Celsius. That translates to 66 degrees Fahrenheit. The 1-0 is low, 2-0. Humidity at 60%. And the wind is out of the west at 21. Not much of a factor here downtown, though. The 2-0. Swung on. That's hit high. Not very deep. Out towards center field. And Boucher's there. And he'll make the catch for the second out. I know there's rain in the area. As northward is Gimli. So far, so good here. And... Just overcast skies. It'd be a lot warmer today if we didn't have that cloud roll in around noon. 
Here's Josh Mazzola with two away, one nothing Quebec leading. And Josh is one for eight in the series, first pitch. He is right down the middle for a strike. And three for 14 on the homestead. The 0-1, down and away, one ball and one strike. One and one. And the pitch. Swung on on that slider and fouled away right side. And it gets out of play. A ball and two strikes. Not a bad gathering today for Father's Day. Free gas giveaway courtesy of Husky Retail today. The pitch is swung on and fouled to the plate. And swinging at that pitch, Mazzola knocked off his elbow pad. And he'll have to affix that to his left elbow again. And get back in the box with a count of one and two on him. One nothing Quebec, two away here, the pitch. Swing and a miss, and the inning comes to an end. So a breaking ball and a swing and a miss, and Crenshaw picks up his first strike out of the afternoon, and the Gold Eyes go one, two, three here in the bottom of one. Zeros across the board. We will go to the second and play the home run inning. One nothing, Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Ever try sucking an orange through a straw? Uh, How about five? Oh, come on! It can happen, because we're blending up a difference at Juco Juice. Our fresh fruit smoothies knock it out of the park with over five servings of fruit jammed into every 24-ounce cup. This season, make it a mini combo with a zesty Southwest chicken wrap. Get healthy on the go with Jugo Juice. Find us at Shaw Park and online at jugojuice.com. Luxury, convenience, comfort. Have it all with Premier Executive Suites. For business travelers who are always on the move, Premier Executive Suites is your home away from home. You can relax in your comfortable living room, grab a midnight snack in your complete kitchen, and do that last-minute load of laundry with your handy in-suite washer and dryer. Book your extended stay in Winnipeg with Premier Executive Suites. Visit premiersuites.com to make your booking today. Take more of your life with you with Premier Executive Suites. Welcome to Rogers Tech Talk. Rog, I'd love to get internet for the cottage, but... Well, with Rogers Wireless Internet, you can get fast Wi-Fi for all your devices, even Dockside. But my wife worries I'll do more work and less play. So download a romantic movie, watch it under the stars. Sorry, is that work or play? Uh, right now, get a Rocket Mobile hotspot for $0 on select two-year plans and take Wi-Fi wherever you go. See store for details. Start saving today with Rogers on the Network with province-wide coverage. <laughs> Hits just keep on coming on your home of the Winnipeg Gold Eyes. TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Top of two, we welcome you. Josue Pelly, Royce Consigli, and Awesome Shaw. Hitters five, six, and seven. For Quebec, they lead it one nothing. And Matt Rush, the former Capital. Delivers the first pitch of the second. It swung on and fell back for strike one. Yes, Matt Rush spent just about two seasons with Quebec. 2010, he was 11 and two with a 3.29 ERA. And 2011, six and four with a 299. Pitch is swung on and fell back on that slider, and it's nothing to two. Overall, 29 starts, a seven and Actually, 29 starts, a 17 and 6 record for Matt Rush, and a 3.10 ERA with Quebec. 0-2 pitch, down and away, 2-2. And then that 2011 season, part of it was with Portland and Double A. One and two here to Josue Pelly. The pitch. Breaking ball swung on, line to center field. That'll drop for a base hit. Slider that got left up in the zone. And Pelly has a leadoff single here. And that's the third hit for Quebec. Uh -huh. And Royce can singly the batter. And can singly 
Stands in from the left-hand side. Looks down to Pat Scalabrini coaching third. And gets a sign. one nothing Quebec. That's their third hit. And the leadoff man aboard here. First pitch. Swung on, fell back to the screen for strike one. Top of two, as always, our home run inning. And we invite you folks to drop into Home Run Sports at De La Seigneury Boulevard. Bishop Grandin entered a win of the Home Run Sports home run inning. Here's how it works. If a Gold Eye player hits a home run in any inning and we pick your name that day, you'll receive an Easton prize package courtesy of Easton Sports. 0-1 on the outside edge for a strike. Good fastball. Nothing to two. But you must hear your name on this program. Not going to be contacted. It's only on this program that we reveal the names of the winners of the Home Run Sports home run inning. 0-2. It's a breaking ball that's low. One ball and two strikes. And if you do hear your name, then you know that you're a winner on the Home Run Sports home run inning. And afterward, you need to contact Home Run Sports within 30 days to claim your prize. You can do that in person or by calling 255-7687. One two pitch. Just missed inside two and two. Came back with a fastball. Well, no homers for the Gold Eyes last night, so no winners here today. Maybe today for tomorrow night. The team starts a three game series in St. Paul against the Saints. It's the Home Run Sports Home Run Inning brought to you by Home Run Sports. Get ready for your game. Two two is on the outside edge for a called third strike. And Consigli will go down looking. First strike out of the afternoon here for Matt Rush. And one down in this second inning. And that first strikeout by Rush brought to you by Manitoba Hydro. Manitoba Hydro reminds you to be safe around electricity. Folks, one strike, and you're out. Here's Awesome Shaw. Stands in from the left side. One out, one on. Top of two, one nothing Quebec. The pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. Oh, man. A run on three hits for Quebec today. They won nine to two last night. Game got away from Winnipeg when they gave up six in the ninth. Oh, one is inside. One ball and one strike. Games today underway at one o'clock was Gary at Fargo. And at 3.16, St. Paul at Wichita. 1-1 one, one is outside. Two balls and one strike. 5.05 today, Kansas City at Lincoln. 6.05, Grand Prairie at Sioux City. Sioux Falls at Amarillo. And at 7.30, El Paso at Laredo. 2-1. Swing and a miss, and it's 2-2. Two and two. Two balls and two strikes. Again, the Gold Eyes today with a victory would pick up franchise win number 1,000. They are at 9-9-9. Rush will come set. The pitch to Shaw. He's about to the dirt. Nice block by Guida. Removes the mask. Finds it by his feet. No advance from Josue Pelly over at first base. Three and two to Shaw, who is 0 for 6 in the series. But he's been aboard a couple of times and scored a run last night as he was hit twice, not once, twice by pitches. A full count. Rush will come set, and the pitch. Runner bluffs, then stumbles, then goes. And the pitch is swung on and fell back. And it gets into the seats. And Pelly will get back. He kind of took a step, went again, stumbled, then carried on. Three balls and two strikes. And the pitch. Swung on, popped up. Left side of the infield. And Nate Sampson is there to make the catch. And the shortstop with a two-handed variety does just that to away. And here's Maxime Lefebvre, who came into the game last night as a pitch runner. 
And Maxime Lefebvre is a switch hitter, hitting 261. And is the DH today. And his first official plate appearance of this series. First pitch is in there for a strike. <laughs> Two away, runner at first base. Lafave with two home runs and nine driven in. The 0-1 is high. One ball and one strike. One and one. Old Eyes will board the bus after this one and head down to St. Paul, Minnesota. A 1-1 pitch is in there for a strike. It's one and two. And they'll start that series against the division rival Saints, 7-0-5 tomorrow night, Midway Stadium. And while we're down there, we'll be intrigued, of course, by the three games, the two teams, the Saints and Gold Eyes, tied for first going into action today in the North. One, two pitch, just missed inside, two and two. But also there is, of course, the new ballpark on the horizon in St. Paul. We'll find out how far along that is. Two, two, swing and a miss, and down on strikes goes Maxime Lefebvre, got a fastball that he just could not handle. Second strike out of the inning and the ball game for Matt Rush. No runs, a leadoff single, one left for Quebec. Bottom two is next, so is Trivia. one nothing Capital on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Ken Plain for Avalon. Do you have cracked basement walls, seepage problems, uneven floors, or sticking doors? Avalon is Western Canada's oldest and largest foundation repair company. Because Avalon repairs more basements than any other company, you shouldn't even think about having your basement repaired without talking to Avalon first. Call the people you can trust at 783-2500. Team's playing great. Yeah, we're up by two. Big deal. I've got a 7,000-point lead. What? You haven't heard? I've had a fantastic season at Husky Stations this year. It's free to join, and it's easy. All you have to do is swipe, earn, and redeem to get great My Husky rewards, like free gas and car washes. My Husky rewards. Visit your local Husky to get a card and start earning today. For more information, visit myhuskyrewards.ca. I've still got a 6,999-point lead on them. The Gold Eyes Field of Dreams Foundation supports children's charities in Manitoba. I'm Tony Fletcher, Foundation President, urging you to get involved with the Fillmore Riley Case for Kids program by pledging a dollar amount per Gold Eyes strikeout. Or show your support by picking up a Gold Eyes license plate from your local auto pack dealer. The foundation receives $30 from each one sold. Thanks to you, the Field of Dreams Foundation has donated more than $1.6 million to children's charities since 1995. We go to the bottom of two. Casey Harther will lead it off. one nothing Quebec, and Dustin Crenshaw works into his second inning. Harther, Davis, the DH, and Lentini. Glad to have you along today. We'll play trivia. In the bottom of this second. How do you folks today? Tuning in on CJ 107.5 in Gimli. CJ 97.1 in Nipawa, Manitoba. And CJ 104.5 in Swan. First pitch to Arthur. is a slider that's in there for a strike. And to everybody... On our flagship station, TSN 1290. Welcome across the network today, and happy Father's Day, the 01. Swung on and looped out toward right field, but right there is Shy. He'll make the catch. And there'll be one down. And the batter, Leonard Davis. Davis was at one point on this homestand. Old for 15, but produced a couple of hits yesterday and is now two for 18. First pitch, 
Swung on, foul back. Real good swing there, good contact. Put it back in toward the backstop. And it's strike one. Leonard batting 258. One swing of the bat from this guy, we could be tied here, the 0-1. Swung on, filleted left side, look at that sky sweep, and he goes past that, and onto the concourse, where it's strike two. Davis, two homers, 10 driven in. 0-2 pitch, change up is low, one ball and two strikes. Leonard from Hanford, California. Took last year off. One two pitch. Swing and a miss. And he went after a breaking ball and fouled it into the mitt of the catcher, Josue Pelly. Just ticked it. And he's out. Strikeout number two for Dustin Trencher. And here is Phelan Latini. Let's play trivia, and trivia is always brought to you by the Place Louis Riel Sweet Hotel in downtown Winnipeg. Place Louis Riel specializing in spacious executive suites. And the first pitch is a slider that's in there for a strike. Lantini, five for seven with three RBI in this series. It's gone well for Phelan. A one. Breaking ball is low, one ball and one strike. Now the average after a three hit night last night and selection as our player of the game is up to 293. One, one. Breaking ball swung on, line to center. That will drop for a base hit. So five sat down in order to start the game for Dustin Crenshaw. And once again, maybe the hottest hitter in this series for Winnipeg, Phelan Lantini, dumps one into center field for his sixth hit in eight trips against Quebec. And the batter is Nate Sampson. Contest for trivia, as always, is open to those that have yet to win this year. First pitch is low ball one. And the reward is a pair of gold eye tickets to a future home game. You'll also be eligible to win the grand prize of a weekend stay at the Place Louis at the end of the season. 1 0 is in there for a strike, and it's 1 and 1. And a snap throw down to first base, and I don't know who had caught more off guard. Lentini, the base runner, diving back in safely, or Lavrette, the first baseman that had to. Make a late reaction catch to that on that snap throw from the catcher, Josue Pelly. The 1-1. One -one. Swung on, that's hit high. Out to left center field. Consigli is there, and he'll make the catch, and the gold eyes are finished here in the bottom of two. No runs, a hit, and one left. We'll go to the third. one nothing. Quebec. Close to the gold eyes baseball from downtown Winnipeg on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. It's summer, the perfect time to kick back and relax with friends and family. This summer, make it easy on yourself with catering by Chicken Delight. From a feast for a few to feeding your whole crew, Chicken Delight will put a smile on everyone's face with their famous chicken, fabulous pizza, ribs that rock, and more. Pick it up or have it delivered. Give us a call or send us your catering order at chickendelight.com. So don't call tonight. When Winnipeggers' stuff exceeds their space, why do so many rely on Storageville? It's so convenient. With two prime locations, 830 Waverly and 123 Reinders at Stapon Road. Access to your locker is really easy. It's totally secure. Every unit is alarmed and video monitored every minute, every day. My house should be so clean. They even have a free cube van to stick your stuff in. Storageville, where Winnipeg stores. Learn more about their wow factors at storageville.ca. 
How has Sonova Credit Union found a way to kiss everyone who walks into our doors without being slapped with a harassment lawsuit? Well, we've got DOGs in our branches. What's a DOG? It's a director of greetings, and it's also a St. Bernard. What, like Beethoven? Yeah, like Beethoven. So what else is Sonova good for? How about no need for appointments ever? Like ever, ever? Yes, ever, ever. Bank brighter with Sonova Credit Union at one of our 11 branches throughout Manitoba. You're listening to Gold Eyes Baseball on TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Brought to you in part by South Beach Casino. Like it, love it. We go to the third inning. One nothing Quebec, and for them it's Carlos Willoughby, and then back to the top of the order and Jeff Helms and Jonathan Mallow nine one and two against Matt Rush. Run on three hits for Quebec on the Culligan in-game line score. First pitch to Willoughby is a little bit high, ball one. Zero and one for Winnipeg on the Culligan in-game line score. Brought to you by Culligan Water, better water, pure and simple. Visit them, culliganwater.com. Pitches inside 2-0. Oh. Actually, better yet, drinkculligan.com. Two balls, no strikes to Willoughby. He's had a good series. Four for six. Two walks. The 2 0 is low. 3 0. And Matt Rush back to the top of the hill looking to throw a strike here. From the full line, the 3 0 is in there for a strike. Took, in, took something a little off it. It might have been the slider, and it's 3 1. Again, we're playing trivia here. Never got to the question last half inning, so we move it along to this third, the 3-1. Swung on, chopper up the first baseline, fielded behind the bag nicely. It's a fair ball, and Harther will take it to the base himself and make the unassisted play. One down. And the batter, Jeff Helps. So we told you contest is open to those that have yet to win this year. The reward is a pair of gold eye tickets to a future home game, and you'll also be eligible to win the grand prize of a weekend stay at the Place Louis at the end of the season. And the number to call, 204-780-1290. First pitch to Helps. Showing bunt, pulling back, taking outside, ball one. And there's the parameters. One ball, no strikes. Pitch. Is in there for a strike, and it's one and one. Well, I'll tell you what, unless you have access to the information today on this one, it is a Sunday Super Stumper. One one. Change up is outside, two and one. Question today is this On three occasions last season, a Winnipeg Gold Eyes pitcher was named the American Association Pitcher of the Week. The pitch is low three and one again on three occasions last season the winnipeg gold eyes pitcher was named the american association pitcher of the week three one it is on the outside edge for a strike it's three and two name them who were they name them 204-780-1290 if you think you know the answer the payoff pitch. Swung on, bounced out towards short. Three hopper up with it, Samson. Good strong throw to first to get the speedy helps. And there's two away. Nothing wrong with the way that middle infield is playing defense right now. And here's Jonathan Mallow. A double and an arm, a double and a run scored here today. Sebastian Boucher has the game's only RBI. Quebec leads it. By a score of 1-0, we're in inning number three. First pitch, swung on, that's hit high. Down the left field line, way back, and gone. A home run for Jonathan Malo. His second extra base hit of the afternoon. He'll score his second run of the afternoon. And he will drive out his fourth home run of the campaign. And it's 2-0, Quebec. First pitch, swinging. it. 
And Quebec has the lead at 2 0 now. And here's Sebastian Boucher. That's a 2 0 solo block. First pitch. Fastball is high. Ball one. Again, just back to the question on three occasions last season, a Winnipeg Gold Eye pitcher was named the American Association Pitcher of the Week. 1 0. On the outside edge for a strike, it's one and one. <laughs> Who were they? Name them. That's what I want to know today. One ball, one strike. And the pitch is low, two and one. I don't know, is it time already for the heinous laugh on Super Stumper Sunday? We'll find out if we first off generate any calls, which is usually a real good sign if you don't, that it is a Super Stumper. The 2-1 is just outside, 3-1. And then if we do, how many calls it takes to get the right answer? Those are our two indicators of super stumper status. 3-1. Swing and a miss. Good breaking ball, and it's 3-2. Manitoba Blue Cross out of town scoreboard. Manitoba Blue Cross, the color of carrying. We're in the third here. It's 2-0 for Quebec. One other game underway. Tim Alberts has hit a grand slam in the first inning for Fargo. His eighth home run of the year, 3-2 is low, ball four. And Fargo's jumped out to a 6-2 lead in the fourth on Gary. As Matt Rush walks his first of the afternoon. So Fargo leads 6-2 over Gary. And coming up at 3-15, St. Paul in Wichita. 5-0-5, Kansas City at Lincoln. 6-0-5, Sioux Falls at Amarillo. 6.05 Grand Prairie at Sioux City. 7.30 El Paso at Laredo. Matt Rush with two away, one in, and a runner over at first, throws over to first. And skipping back in there is Boucher, who was caught stealing for the second out in inning number one. Number of games in the American League are matinees today. They're in the seventh in Cleveland. First pitch is swung on and fouled off the end of the bat. And Rennie Labrette has strike one on him. Cleveland leading Washington 1-0 in that seventh inning. In the only interleague game. Baltimore is hosting Boston. It's 3-0 for the Orioles. Helped along by a Chris Davis home run is 23rd. Baltimore two and a half back of Boston entering action today. They win that game. They're a game and a half back, of course. 0-1 is in there for a strike, and it's nothing to two. Fifth inning, Tampa and Kansas City are tied at two. Third inning, Houston is shutting out Chicago. That being the White Sox. Houston three. White Sox no score. In inning number three. Detroit helped along in a home run by Torrey Hunter, his third, leading Minnesota 2-0 in Minneapolis today. The pitch swung on, fouled back by Lebrecht, and he stays alive at nothing and two. Just underway, Toronto at Texas. And the Blue Jays looking for their fifth straight win. They are 7-3 and three in their last 10. They have the best record in their last 10 games in the East Division. The 0-2 pitch. Breaking ball down and away. One ball and two strikes. The problem for the Blue Jays is not necessarily against other divisions. They're 6-3 and three against the West. They go to 7-3 and three with a victory over Texas again today. 1-2, runner of the move, pitches outside, throw down to second, will not be in time, and Boucher will have a stolen base, his sixth of the season. And the count, 2-2 two and two to Lavrette. Really, it's not against the Central either. They're just one game under 500 at 7-8. and eight. The Blue Jays' problem this year has been in their own division where they're eight games under 500 at 12 and 20. 
two and two to Lebrett. The pitch swung on, and that is hit out to right field. That'll drop for a base hit, making the turn at third is Boucher. Here comes the throw. Won't be in time. They're going to throw up to second, and they're going to get Lebrett into a rundown, and they will apply a tag, will Nate Sampson, on him for the third out of the inning. But it's an RBI single. The run will count to make it 3-0 Quebec, and then the out will go 9-2-6. and six. And Quebec scores twice in this third inning and has their largest lead of the afternoon. Two runs, two hits, including a home run, and nobody left. We'll go to the bottom of three. Winnipeg's got to get on the stick. 3 nothing Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Going on vacation can be exciting. Bon voyage, Winnipeg. But when you're miles away from Winnipeg, the last thing you want to worry about is the security of your home. That's why Commissioners Manitoba offers a house watch service. They'll do an interior and exterior patrol of your property, bring in your mail, remove snow from your car, even water your plants. Don't leave your house to chance. Leave it to the Commissioners. Go to commissioners.mb.ca. Summer in Manitoba sizzles all over the place, from our great beaches to our great ballpark. And I just don't mean on the field. I mean on Goldie's Grill, where they sizzle up some of the best hot dogs you've ever tasted. Diamond Dogs, the official hot dog of the Gold Eyes, custom made by Winkler Meats. Diamond Dogs are naturally smoked, gluten and allergen free, and made with quality ingredients that deliver full flavor every bite. Try them at the game or pick them up at your local grocer. Diamond Dogs from Winkler Meats. Product quality is our tradition. Ken Plain for Avalon. Do you have cracked basement walls, seepage problems, uneven floors, or sticking doors? Avalon is Western Canada's oldest and largest foundation repair company. Because Avalon repairs more basements than any other company, you shouldn't even think about having your basement repaired without talking to Avalon first. Call the people you can trust at 783-2500. Bottom of three, we welcome you back. My name is Paul Edmonds. Tim Debenham is our producer and operator back at our flagship station. Riley Lechuk is up and out on CJ Radio. And Brendan McGranahan on site here. It's 3-0 Quebec. Nick Lyles to lead it off for Winnipeg against Dustin Crenshaw. First pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. Lyles, Guida, and Graham. 8-9-1. and one. And the 0-1 is low. One ball, one strike. We were talking about scores and later games going on. At 2.30 today, so in about 12 minutes time. 1-1. Swung on, bounced out toward third, fielded by Malo. Shuffles and throws across the diamond. And Nick Lyles retired for the first out. Jordan got in the batter. 2.30 today, the Yankees are in Los Angeles to take on the Angels. And CC Sabathia getting the start for the Bronx Bombers. He's six and five against Jared Weaver for the Halos, who's one and two. First pitch to Gaida. Wing and a miss for strike one. Howie Kendrick for the Halos in his last 10 games is batting 568. 01. Swung on and looped over short, dumped into left field for a base hit. Jordan Guida has his second hit in 12 official at bats as a gold eye and a one out single here. And Tyler Gray of the batter. 3 0 Quebec leads it. Kendrick is 21 for 37 in his last 10 games, hitting 568. And coming up at 3 o'clock today, Seattle at Oakland. Asashi Iwakuma, 7-1 for the M's. Bartolo Colon, 8-2 for the A's. And Graham showed bunt, ran out of the box. They say he broke the plane of the plate, strike one. He did not make contact, however. Three games underway in the National League, and then some later starts this afternoon in the game tonight at 7.05 in Atlanta, the 0-1. Swung on, tapper left side, charged there by Alp. Running pick up and a throw to first, not in time. And Tyler Graham with some real good wheels 
using them for an infield single. And the Gold Eyes have something cooking here with two on and one out for Amos Ramon. And Ramon will step in from the right side. That game tonight, Atlanta hosting San Francisco. And it's Tim Lincecum, four and six for the Giants. Julio Terran, four and three for the Braves at 7.05 tonight in Hotlanta. In the seventh inning, Miami leading St. Louis six to one today. Also in the sixth, the Cubs, three nothing leaders over New York at City Field in Queens, New York. Crenshaw comes set, first pitch to Ramon. He is in there for a strike. Sixth inning, Cincinnati helped along in a home run by Jay Bruce, his 12th, leading Milwaukee 3-1. to one. Carlos Gomez has accounted for the Brewers' lone run with his 12th jack of the year. The 0-1 is down and away with a breaking ball, and Ramon laid off of that. One ball, one strike. First inning, Dodgers at Pittsburgh are scoreless at 3-10 today. Philadelphia at Colorado. Hamels two and nine, Chassin two and three for the Phillies and Rockies respectively. 310 today. Under appeal of suspension, Ian Kennedy four and three for the Arizona Diamondbacks. The one one. Swung on, followed away right side, and out of play. And Clayton Richard counters for San Diego one and five. 7.05, as I mentioned, San Francisco at Atlanta. Basketball returns tonight. San Antonio's the venue. Miami at San Antonio. Tip-off at 7. Series tied at 2. 1-2. One, two. Swung on, line to left. That'll get down for a base hit. Rounding the bag at third. Coming in to score is going to be Guida. It'll be an RBI single for Amos Ramon. Winnipeg's on the board. Stopping at second is Tyler Graham. And how about Amos extending it to an 11 game hitting streak? Three to one, Quebec. Hard hit ball by Amos. Line drive to left. And here's Josh Mazzola. Just another note on that NBA championship final, tied at two. Spurs have not lost consecutive games this postseason. It's a good series, tied at two. Here's Mazzola. Stands in from the right side, first pitch. Is inside, ball one. That's our first look at the Manitoba Blue Cross out of town. Scoreboard today, Manitoba Blue Cross, the color of carrying. Mazzola 0 for 1 this afternoon. He struck out his first trip. One of two strikeouts for Dustin Crenshaw. The 1-0, runners on the move, pitch is low, throw down to second, not in time. Stolen base for Amos Ramon. Tyler Graham on the front end of that will pick up his seventh stolen base, and Amos will get his second. Double steal for Winnipeg. And the count is one ball and one strike, I believe, to Mazzola. They post two balls and no strikes on the board. It's one and one. The 1-1 one -one is outside, and it's two balls and one strike. So one swing of the bat, one little flare here, and the Gold Eyes will have a chance to tie. They trail 3-1, runners at second and third, and this is a scenario where they did not do well in last night. The 2-1 is outside, three balls and one strike. Mazzola, three homers, 11 driven in. And Crenshaw comes out the 3-1 pitch. Is in there for a strike, and it's 3-2. and two. Mazzola, with runners on base, batting 283 with two of his three home runs. Runners in scoring position, batting 185, the pitch. Swung on, bounced out towards short, fielded by Helps in a high hop. He'll pull it down and throw across to get Mazzola, but a run will score as Tyler Graham makes it 3-2. Mazzola will pick up his 12th run batted into the year, and there'll be two away. And Amos had to hold it second for Casey Harther. 
And Arthur standing in, 0 for 1 today. With runners in scoring position and two outs, he's hitting 150. First pitch. Breaking ball is high, ball one. 3-2, Quebec in front. The Gold Eyes have answered with a pair in the bottom of this third after giving up a deuce in the top half of this inning. The difference right now is that one run in the first for La Capitale, the 1-0. Is down and away, two balls and no strikes. Arthur has hits in 16 of his last 17 games, baby. That's a pretty good run. He'd love to make it 17 of 18 right here and drive Ramon in. The 2 0 swung on and popped up into right field. Awesome Shaw right there, walking a couple of steps to his left or right. He'll make the catch, and the Gold Eyes are done here in the bottom of three. However, they get on the board and get back into it. A little bit of life here offensively. Two runs, three hits, one left. We'll go to the fourth. 3-2 Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Wow, we're finally doing it. Building our dream home. I never thought we'd be able to afford it. Well, we did some good saving, and SCU did the rest. Sweet. Can this be my room? Uh, this will be the kitchen, bud. Perfect. Whether you're fixing, building, or buying, feel comfortable in a mortgage from Steinbeck Credit Union. Ready to build? SCU is there with builder mortgages, great rates, and flexible terms. Talk to SCU today. After all, we're taking care of the world's most important mortgage, yours. She sang with poise and grace beyond her years. And the fire continued to burn throughout the night. 18-year championship drought is over, Winnipeg baseball fans. With the best local, national, and international coverage, the Winnipeg Free Press is there for you. With an unrivaled art section and the best coverage in sports. Because you care about what's happening in our city. The Winnipeg Free Press. Call 204-697-7001 to subscribe today. What's for dinner? Let's barbecue. Turkey? Granny's Poultry introduces their seasoned turkey breast roast. Perfect for the barbecue. Sounds good. Really good. Designed for optimum juiciness, Granny's seasoned turkey breast roast is so tasty. And it's available at your neighborhood Safeway store. Granny's Poultry, your local poultry farmer's cooperative. For simple and simply delicious recipes, visit grannies.ca. Granny's, good natured. The stats, the stories, and everything. Every swing for the fences. It's Gold Eyes Baseball on TSN 1290. TSN1290.ca. Top of the fourth inning, 3 2 Quebec in front. Josue Pelly, the batter. Followed by Royce Consigli. First pitch from Rush is inside ball one. An awesome Shaw. Hitters 5 6 7. See how the Gold Eyes do here. In order to keep the momentum going in the game, you really don't want to lose the leadoff guy in this situation. 1-0. Is down and away. Two balls and no strikes. By the way, we have a winner on trivia. And the winner and the answer coming up in inning number seven this afternoon. The 2-0 pitch. Swung on, grounded out toward third. Up with it easily. Shuffling is Ramon. Throw across. And there's one away. I think Pele only got halfway down toward first. And here's Royce Consigli. Let's have a look at the Culligan in-game line score brought to you by Culligan Water. Better water, pure and simple. May was drinking water month. I think every month should be drinking water month. You need to hydrate. Good for your organs, good for your body. First pitch. Swung on, that is blasted out to straightaway center. Back goes Tyler Graham onto the track, and he turns, faces us, makes the catch, and then backs up to the wall. Boy, can Sigley with seven home runs this year gave that a ride, but the ballpark will hold it, and a great running catch by Tyler Graham, and there's two away for awesome Shaw. Culligan Water, by the way, locally owned and operated since 1956, serving Winnipeg and surrounding area. Contact them at drinkculligan.com. First pitch is high, ball one. Three runs, five hits for Quebec today. Two runs, four hits. 
at Camp Goldeye. And the 1 0 to Shaw. Swing and a miss, and that fastball, and it's 1 and 1. Ossov is 0 for 7 in this series, hitting 260 on the year. Kind of sits up inside. The pitch is right there. Didn't get the strike call from Thomas Perko, and it's 2 and 1. And the 2 1 pitch is low green one three balls one strike and the three one is outside ball four so a two on free pass to awesome Shaw second walk issued by Matt Rush today, and here is Maxime Lefebvre, the DH, who struck out his first trip. And Lefebvre steps in from the left side. First pitch. He is on the outside edge for a strike. Fave today, 0 for 1. He entered the series last night as a pinch runner. And the pitch is swung on and missed, and it's nothing to two. Maxime Lefebvre was born in Versailles, France. Obviously now makes his home in Quebec. Drafted by the Seattle Mariners. 0-2 is outside, one ball, two strikes. And I'm trying to ascertain all this in reading French. As the media guide that they've provided us, of course, pitch is swung on and missed, and that's it for Lefebvre, is all in French. It's very good, but you kind of have to work your way through it and remember what it was like in grade 11 French class. No runs, no hits, one left. Matt Rush picks up his third strike out of the afternoon. And we have three and a half in the books. We'll go to the bottom of the fourth inning. 3-2 Quebec City on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Downtown Winnipeg is the place to be this summer. Get downtown and enjoy fun festivals, concerts, and tours. Catch a Gold Eyes game, visit exceptional shopping and dining districts, get a taste for Winnipeg's distinct urban culture, and check out the Out to Lunch concert series with free music downtown every Wednesday at noon all summer long. For info on concert locations and other downtown events, visit downtownwinnipegbiz.com. Get down this summer. Downtown. Going to university this fall? Here are five top reasons to consider the University of Winnipeg. One, the convenient downtown location. Two, high quality education. Three, excellent professors. Four, more than $3 million in scholarships and bursaries available. And five, small class sizes where you can really connect with your profs and classmates. To learn more about the University of Winnipeg, call 204-779-UWIN or visit uwinnipeg.ca. It's not too late to apply. Here's the pitch, and it's a grand slam! Here they come, cans, juice boxes, glass and plastic bottles, into the bin! The Winnipeg Gold Eyes and Recycle Everywhere want you to swing for the fences and recycle all your empty beverage containers. They're full of potential and have thousands of uses beyond the landfill. Step up to the plate and pitch your drink containers into a recycling bin. Whether you're at home, work, school, or the ballpark, Remember to recycle everywhere. Bottom of the fourth inning, Leonard Davis to lead it off. 3-2 Quebec, but the Gold Eyes have scored the last two runs. Davis, the DH today, is 0 for 1. He struck out. First pitch from Crenshaw. He is in there for a strike. Quebec getting one in the first, two in the third. Gold Eyes getting two in the third as well. That's the difference, the 0-1. Swung on, ground ball right side. Two hopper to Willoughby. Second baseman up with it over to first. One away. 
And then Lentini and Sampson do up here in this fourth inning as well. It's a nice day. You can feel the you can feel the warmth. It's warm today. There is cloud cover over top of us. Boy, if it was ever to lift, it might have some of the humidity dissipate, but the heat would go up in terms of the air temperature. Phelan Lantini, one for one here today. Got a home run on Friday night, first pitch. is a slider on the outside edge for a strike. We're in the bottom of four. Dustin Crenshaw working into his fourth, the 0-1. Swung on, fouled back. Right side, out of play. Nothing in two. Once again, fans, Wendy's Restaurants and Baseball Manitoba have teamed up to form a great partnership. The joint initiative provides an opportunity for all minor baseball players in the province. There's some 9,000 kids in the province playing baseball. 0-2. Swung on, bounced out towards short. Helps coming in, running pickup, and a throw to first. And a good stretch there by Lebrat. And it all works in Quebec's favor. There's two aways. Lentini's out at first base. And Nate Sampson, the batter. Yeah, everybody that signed up for minor baseball in the province got to learn a little bit more about the gold eyes and the game through a full-color baseball booklet that was distributed to all players following registration for minor baseball in the province. Plus, Wendy's has again provided each player with a free Frosty. First pitch he is in there for a strike to Sampson. Redeemable in any Wendy's location in Manitoba. The Gold Eyes, Wendy's, and Baseball Manitoba, a guaranteed triple play. The 0-1 swung on, and that is Q shot it off the end of the bat over by one of those camera wells. And it's strike two. Nothing in two to Nate Sampson. He's 0 for 1 today. 0 for 7 in the series. 0-2 pitch. Breaking ball is high. One ball and two strikes. One and two. And the pitch is down and away. Half a swing. Sampson did not go around as they appeal. And Mike O'Leary tells us what we already knew over at first base. Two and two. Tomorrow, Mark Hardy getting the start against the Saints. Two-two pitch. Swung on, that's hit high, not very deep. Left left center, Consigli is there. He'll make the catch, and the Gold Eyes go one, two, and three in the last of the fourth. We'll go to the fifth. Quebec leads it by one, three, two. You're listening to Gold Eyes Baseball on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Hey, what's up? It's me, your manly pickup truck. We've had some fun times, you and me, huh? Hauling things, carrying things, trucking things. Okay, so they're the same thing, but that's what I'm here for. Am I right, my brother? Hoorah! Anyway, no big deal. But if you had a sec, I could really use a, a little me time with Mr. Lube. It's like a day spa. Uh, the kind of spa where you bench press things. Manly things. Yeah. Get top to bottom maintenance from Mr. Lube and take good care. Support your own. The Gold Eyes and Fort Gary Brewing. Located right here in Winnipeg, Fort Gary Brewing is Manitoba's number one brewery, crafting a full spectrum of delicious beers and ales, including the award winning Fort Gary Dark, fan favorite Fort Gary Pale, and team inspired Angry Fish Pilsner. All are available at Shaw Park. So cheer on the home team. Fort Gary Brewing, Manitoba made, Manitoba zone. Selkirk Chrysler's massive factory authorized truck sale is on now. Find a huge selection of 2013 Ram pickups, quad cab, crew cab, regular cab, gas, diesel, we have them and they're on sale. Savings up to 17 grand with super low financing. Like the quad cab 4x4 with new 8-speed automatic transmission featuring an incredible 33 miles per gallon at just $169 bi-weekly. Only at Selkirk Chrysler's factory authorized truck sale. Details at SelkirkChrysler.com Grand Slam Gold Eyes coverage with Paul Edmonds. This is TSN 1290. TSN1290.ca Top of the fifth inning. Carlos Willoughby to lead it off for Quebec. They lead it 3-2 here. Willoughby helps and Malo hitters 9-1-2 against Matt Rush. It 
was a 3-0 lead for La Capitale at one point before the Gold Eyes cut into it. Now it's a one-run differential. First pitch. Showing Bunt pulling back, taking inside, ball one. One ball, no strikes to Carlos Willoughby, who's 0 for 1 today and 4 for 7 in the series. 1-0. He is on the outside edge for a strike, and it's 1-1. One one. Uh, this place has filled up decently today. I'm sure there was some walk-up. 1-1. One, one. Is in there for a strike. Good change-up, and it's 1-2. And... Two. and we're starting to see a little bit of blue sky over top of us. Wind is still not really a factor here in downtown. One, two pitch, swung on, fouled the plate. Good hack there by Willoughby, but it bounced right back down in the box and back toward the screen. It's a ball and two to the left-handed swinging. Second baseman who's actually a switch hitter but batting from the left side against the righty and Matt Rush. The one-two from Rush. Cold third strike on the outside corner. Great fastball right there. And Willoughby goes down looking. Strikeout number four for Rush here on the day. And there's one away for Jeff Helps. And Helps is 0 for 2. Here today, he's bounced out. Harther and Rush, and then out to short. Sampson and Arthur. First pitch is low, ball one. Helps batting 248. He's two for eight in the series with three walks. The 1 0 is in there for a strike, and it's one and one. Gold Eyes here at home, you know, we've talked today about winning this series with a victory today. Win number 1,000, pitch is swung on and hit to the gap in left center. On the run goes Tyler Graham, and he will get there into the gap in left center from center and make a one-handed catch, closing the distance, and those two away. We talked about if the Gold Eyes were to win today, it would be a win in this series. It would be win number 1,000 of their franchise or for the franchise. It would also get their home record to 500 at 6-6. Six and six. Here's Jonathan Mallow. He's been a one-man wrecking crew today. First pitch is swung on and missed, and that slider for strike one. He had a double and scored in the first and a single or a solo home run in the third. Two runs scored, two extra base hits. He's two for two. Three for ten in the series, the pitch. Swung on, hit to center field. Graham back, now over, and he'll reach up and make the catch. And it's a one, two, three, fifth. And Quebec goes in order. Zeroes across the board. We'll go to the bottom of the fifth. Quebec still leading by one at 3-2 on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Impaired driving kills 30 people each year in Manitoba. Every drink affects your ability to drive safely. You might miss a stop sign or not see another vehicle. Maybe you don't notice the pedestrian crosswalk and you can't see the person walking right in front of you. If you plan to drink, plan ahead to get home safely. Don't drink and drive. A message from Manitoba Public Insurance. If I said to you, you had a beautiful body, would you hold it against me? Well, not if you got the body work done at Moray Auto Body, because beautiful body work is what they do best. They're not part of some giant chain, so they treat every customer like their only customer, and that means attention to detail like you wouldn't believe. Frame straightening, expert refinishing, even boat repairs, painting, and deckling. Moray Auto Body does it all and does it right. Really right. Right where you'd expect them to be, at 700 Moray. These guys hit it right out of the park. Now, I, I'm not afraid to take risks under the perfect ideal conditions, but when it comes to pizza, I'll stick with Santa Lucia pizza. I mean, why risk getting anything less than Santa Lucia, voted best pizza in Winnipeg by Uptown Magazine readers for six straight years and winner of the Consumer Choice Award for best pizza restaurant for seven years? I mean, after all, 
This is pizza we're talking about. Don't risk ordinary pizza. Get Winnipeg's best at Santa Lucia Pizza. Dine in, take out, or home delivery. You see, the best ingredients make the best pizza. Well, we go to the bottom of the fifth inning, and we welcome you back. 3-2, Quebec is in front, wherever you're tuning in from today. Nick Lyles, Jordan Guida, and Tyler Graham. Eight, nine, and one. Due up against Dustin Crenshaw. And we'll discuss this interleague situation. If the Gold Eyes were to win today, it would be their first interleague series win. First pitch to Nick Lyles. He is in there for a strike. Now, in a lot of respects, I guess you could say, well, was Albany in 99, New Jersey 01 and 02 interleague? No, I guess technically not. Pitch is swung on and lined out to left and on the run and off the glove of Consigli, it goes. And it goes to the wall and in standing at second base with a double is Nick Lyles. Hard hit ball by Lyles. And Consigli kind of looked like he was going to get there and matter of fact make the catch. And all of a sudden he lifted the glove and it went off the top of the glove. I think he didn't realize how hard it was hit, but it was smoked to left center by Lyles. And it's a leadoff double, and the Gold Eyes have the potential tie and run aboard. Jordan Guida one for one with a run scored, maybe looking to lay down a bunt right here. Corners are thinking that way. They're in on the grass. Crenshaw comes set, first pitch. Swung on and fouled back by Guida. No sign of a bunt right there. I guess, again, depending on your perspective, Albany, New Jersey, were not interleague. They were in the same league as the Gold Eyes back in 99, 01, and 02. And now got to show his bunt in the pitch. Is fouled at the plate, and it's strike two. Remember, for four years between 99 and 02, what was the Northeast League became the Northern League East. And the teams here in southern Manitoba, the upper Midwest and Midwest, were the Northern League Central. 0-2. Swung on, bounced out toward third, fielded by Malo. Looks the runner back, throws across to get Guida. And there's one away. So Nick Lyles standing at second base. And here's Tyler Graham. So if the Gold Eyes were to win today, it would be their first interleague series win. Remember, they were swept 0-3. Was their record before winning on Friday night as Quebec rolled in here in July and won all three games last year. Here's Tyler Graham. First pitch he is down and away, ball one. He's one for two today. A stolen base and a run scored. I guess you could look at it in a larger picture. Overall, the Gold Eyes have never won a series against the team from the East. 1-0 is low, two balls and no strikes. They lost in four games in the Northern League Championship Series to Albany Colony in 1999. Lost in four games to New Jersey for the League Championship Series in 01 in four games. And again, lost in four against New Jersey in 0-2. 2-0 is low and inside, three balls and no strikes. And then last year, 0-3, getting swept. Three balls and no strikes to Graham. The pitch is low, ball four. And Crenshaw will walk his first of the afternoon, and it puts two on with one out for Amos Ramon. And Ramon, an RBI single already today. And he's also flown out. Amos drove the gold eyes. First run of the baseball game in with a solid single to extend a hitting streak to 11 straight. First pitch is a breaking ball in there for a strike. When you take those series against those Eastern teams, Albany in 99, 
New Jersey in 01, New Jersey in 02 again. And those first three, of course, were Northern League Championship Series when they were three rounds. The 01 swung on. That's hit to center field. Back goes Boucher, and he will drift toward the gap and make the catch. And now the throw will come in, and the gold eyes just about got crossed up running the bases. It's caught out there by Boucher for the second out, and everybody gets back to the respective base safely. Lyle stays at second. Graham had to get back to first. He wanted to tag up, but Lyles wasn't moving from second to third, and here's Josh Mazzola. The Gold Eyes, historically, four wins, 14 losses against teams from the East. Four and 14 is the Gold Eyes franchise record against teams from the East. First pitch to Mazzola. Is a breaking ball on the inside edge for a strike. Josh is 0 for 2 today, 1 for 10 in the series. He has driven in a run today, his 12th. 3-2 Quebec, bottom 5, 2-0, 2 on. The 0-1 is down and away. One ball and one strike. Yeah, not a great record. 4-14 four and 14 over the years. And obviously the Gold Eyes will be able to improve on that with potentially a win today. And... Ten more to go out east in July. 1-1. One, one. Breaking ball swung on. Bounced out towards short. Helps will pick it up. Shuffles and throws. And a good stretch again by LeBret. And the Gold Eyes are done here in the bottom of the fifth. Curse of the leadoff double. No runs. One hit. Two left. We'll go to the sixth. 3-2 Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Did you know that water makes up more than half of your body weight? Every cell, tissue, and organ in your body needs water to maintain its temperature, remove waste, and lubricate joints. Culligan's filtered bottled water delivered right to your door is the best choice for hydration. Call or click today to enjoy Culligan bottled water service for as little as $21.75 a month. Just call 204-694-5180 or visit drinkculligan.com. Culligan, better water, pure and simple. Limited time offer. Dealer participation may vary. See dealer for details. Hi, I'm Chris Walby. Simplicity Lawn Tractors are known for giving the best cut. Now your friends at Yetman's Limited would like to introduce you to the Simplicity Region EX Lawn Tractor. The Region EX is designed to bring you more performance, comfort, durability, and value. And best of all, because it's a Simplicity, you're getting the best cut. No one can beat it. So hurry and test drive the Simplicity Region EX today. For a Simplicity dealer near you, contact Yetman's Limited in Winnipeg. Hey, Simplicity, the way to a beautiful lawn. Is this the year you catch the big one? It could be if you got the right bait and tackle from Pro-Am Tackle, Winnipeg's exclusive pro shop. Rods, reels, GPS, fish finders, trolling motors, you name it, Pro-Am's got it. And the price is right. Service is exceptional, and they have the only live bait tank in town. So make this the year you haul in more than ever before with a little help from Pro-Am Tackle. Winnipeg's premier bait shop, 1094 Nairn Avenue. You're listening to Go Eyes Baseball with Paul Edmonds on TSN 1290. TSN 1290.ca. Well, we go to the sixth inning. 3-2, Quebec is in front. Sebastian Boucher, Rene Lebret, and Josue Pelly. It is 3-4 and 5. And Boucher today is one for one with a walk, an RBI, a stolen base, and a run scored. Matt Rush works into his sixth. First pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. I know Matt wasn't completely enamored with the fact that the way the rotation worked last year, it didn't allow for him to pitch against Quebec. 0-1. Breaking ball is outside one ball, one strike. He did this year, and he makes his second start on this homestand, and in the finale of this three-game series, the 1-1. Fastball, the inside edge for a strike, 1-2. and two. Just to finish a thought, the Gold Eyes will have 10 games coming up out east, starting on July the 11th. 1-2 pitch, change up, swung on, lifted to center field. Tyler Graham is right there. He'll make the catch. One away. And it's Quebec 
for four, 11, 12, 13, and 14 of July. 12 of the year, 15, 16, and 17, and then Rockland, 18, 19, and 20. Now the Gold Eyes will have an off day to get back home on the 21st and then have the golf tournament on the 22nd. Here's Rennie Lebret, one for two today. Four for nine in the series, first pitch. Fastball missed inside, ball one. Apparently the stadium, the facility in Quebec City exactly the same as Trois Rivières. They're both this year, the venues, that is, celebrating their 75th anniversary. 1-0 is outside, 2-0. And, oh. and the ballpark in Rockland is brand new. Two balls and no strikes. And the pitch in there for a strike, and it's 2-2. Two two. Lebrett was not even concerned about that pitch. He was almost backing out of the batter's box as it came in. And the pitch is down and away, and they have three and one on the board, but I thought they might have missed one here unless that was no pitch. The previous offering from Matt Rush. Three balls and a strike to Lebret. And the pitch. Swung on, lined out to left field, and right at Lantini, who makes his shoestring catch. Two away. Nice grab by Phelan. And the batter is Josue Pelly. We're in the sixth inning. 3-2 Quebec, and the sun has popped out here. First pitch is inside, ball one. One ball, no strikes. L.A. is one for two today, a base hit, and he bounced out the pitch. Swung on, lifted out toward right field. Mazzola coming hard, and he'll get there and make the catch. Four out, number three. And they retire the side to the Gold Eyes on Quebec in order. Zeros across the board. We'll go to the bottom of six. Three, two, Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. It's furniture that has a story to tell. Discover the unrivaled character and craftsmanship only Manitoba Made can offer with Prairie Barnwood. Prairie Barnwood specializes in handcrafted furniture and decor made from dismantled barns from across the Canadian prairies. From mantles to countertops, furniture, even custom pieces, it's all made in Manitoba. See these one-of-a-kind works of art for yourself. Learn more about Manitoba Reap Claim Barnwood Furniture today at prairiebarnwood.com. When you finally decide on the perfect paint color, the last thing you want is someone inexperienced painting in your house. Trust the experts. Trust Cache Painting. For over 28 years, they've perfected their craft right here in Winnipeg. No job is too small or big. Interior or exterior, primers, sealers, and finishes, even stucco coating and painting. Cache Painting excels at it all. Call 204-297-9000 now. Cache Painting, a sign of superior quality. Got all your bases covered? With Manitoba Blue Cross, you do. They provide peace of mind for you and your family, no matter what the situation. Planning on taking a little family trip? Make sure to get travel coverage from Blue Cross. Looking for more benefits for your employees? Look no further than Blue Cross. They also handle individual life insurance. It's a real triple play. Contact your insurance broker or visit nb.bluecross.ca. Manitoba Blue Cross, color of caring. Bottom six, we welcome you back. Quebec leads this one by a score of three to two. They've led, they have led since the opening inning. And for the fifth time in six games, the Gold Eyes have given up a run in inning number one on this homestand. Here's Casey Harther, first pitch. Is a breaking ball high. 
Ball one from Dustin Crenshaw. Yeah, five of six games on this homestand. Gold Eyes have given up a run or more in the top of the first. Pitches inside, 2-0. Oh. Arthur Davis, the DH, and Lentini. Part of the order, 4-5-6. The 2-0 -oh pitch. Swung on, that's hit the center field. Boucher is there, and he will make the catch for out number one. And the batter, Leonard Davis. Well, let's have a look at Gold Eyes this week, brought to you by Boston Pizza. Hoey, come and try Boston Pizza's new meteor, fall off the bone ribs. Boston Pizza, if you ain't ribbing, you ain't living. First pitch to Davis is outside, ball one. Oh, well, did you hear that from some kid? He said, come on, Leonard, you promised me a home run, the 1-0. Swung on, chopper off the plate, right side. It's going to be picked up by Crenshaw. The pitcher will easily underhand it to first base, and they'll be two away for Phelan Lantini. Lantini is one for two. Well, first off, let's have a look at a Paul's pick here before we tell you about what's going on. And that's a game coming up. In fact, two of them. Next homestand, Thursday, June 20th, Jamaica night with a Jamaica trip giveaway. One lucky fan will leave the game with a trip for two to beautiful Jamaica, courtesy of Air Canada Vacations. First pitch is swung on and fouled back, and that might get down into the seats. Scott Taylor, look out. Right next to you. It landed on his desk, not paying attention. What's the old rule? Keep your eye on the ball. The pitch swung on, lifted out toward right, and with his eye on the ball, as Asif Shaw toward the line, he'll make the catch, and the gold eyes go one, two, three. Here in the bottom of inning number six. These two pitchers seem to have settled in a little bit. We'll go to the seventh, three, two, Quebec of the gold eyes radio network. Mmm, nice and fresh. Ah, uh, just the way I like it. Mmm, this is really good. Ah, uh, that hits the spot. The spot to hear all that contentment, our very own fishbowl. The reason? Robbins. Smart coffee lovers count on the famous always fresh taste of Robbins coffee to add extra zest to every Gold Eyes game. Team it with a Robbins fresh baked treat and you've got, well, a flavor double header. Robbins, fast, fresh, and friendly. Most days, you can predict what life's going to throw at you. He's two for two at bat so far today. But every once in a while, strike! Oh, he did not see that coming. When life throws you a curveball, Ranger Insurance will protect what's important to you. Whether it's home, life, auto, or commercial, they have a plan that fits your needs. Ranger Insurance, putting relationships first. For the protection you deserve, visit rangerinsurance.ca. Cannon is celebrating 40 pitcher perfect years in Canada, and Don's photo is passing the savings on to you with 40th anniversary deals like the Cannon PowerShot SX500 anniversary bundle. Includes the Cannon PowerShot SX500, 4 gig SD card, and mini tripod, all for just $239.99. Super zoom, super compact, and perfect for sports action or wide angle travel shots. Hurry, the Cannon 40th anniversary sale ends June 16th. Don's photo with three Winnipeg locations. You're listening to Gold Eyes Baseball on TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Brought to you in part by South Beach Casino. Like it, love it. We go to the seventh inning. 3-2, Quebec in front. They have led since scoring one in the first, two in the third. The Gold Eyes responded with two of themselves in the bottom of the third inning. And now Matt Rush will face Royce Consigli. Asim Shaw and Maxine Lafay. There are a number of Canadians on this team for Quebec. Of course, of course, mostly from the province of Quebec. This guy, Royce Consigli, is from Welland, Ontario. First pitch. Swung on. That's hit high. 
Out to right field. Mazzola was back, now in, and now Lyles will go back, and now Mazzola will call off the second baseman coming in. Either way, they get it done. Mazzola makes the catch, one down, and Awesome Shaw, the batter. Again, just to let you know about Gold Eyes this week for Boston Pizza, if you ain't ribbon, you ain't living. Awesome Shaw, 0 for 1 with a walk. Fans trying to help out Matt Rush. The pitch is in there for a strike. Thursday, June 20th, Jamaica night. One lucky fan will leave the game with a trip for two to beautiful Jamaica, courtesy of Air Canada Vacations. The 0-1. Swung on, line to center field. Tyler Graham in control to his left. He'll make the catch. Two away. The batter is Maxime Lefebvre. Well, the Gold Eyes head out of town after the game tonight. And they will play for the next three nights, starting tomorrow evening in St. Paul. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. First pitch is in there for a strike. Speaking of St. Paul, I was kind of thinking about this today. The Gold Eyes have had some success in St. Paul over the years in the regular season. 0-1 is outside, 1-1. One and, one. and if memory serves, the Gold Eyes have only played St. Paul in the playoffs. No, they played them three times. And they have won a series. 1-1 one, one is inside, 2-1. They lost in 95 to Saints, to the Saints in the League Championship Series. And then never met the Saints again until 2003. They won the first round in a fifth and deciding game. 2-1. Swing and a miss and a changeup. It's 2-2. Two and, two. and then the Saints beat the Gold Eyes in 2011 in the fifth and deciding game of the first round. So... It's one and two in terms of playoff series for Winnipeg. 2-2 to Lefebvre. Swung on, fouled back, and that will get on top of the roof here. The count still two balls and two strikes, and she rolled right back down. Two balls, two strikes to Lefebvre. He struck out twice, one of four strikeouts for Rush today. The 2-2 two -two is high with a fastball, 3-2. And then the Gold Eyes will come right back home after the game on Wednesday to host Lincoln for four here at home. This is part of the stretch where they're home for 11 of the next 14. Pitches swung on and missed, and Lefebvre has struck out three times today, and Matt Rush has a handful of strikeouts, and we have six and a half of the book. Zeros across the board as Matt Rush is now retired. How about this? Ten in a row. Stretch time in my hometown. We invite you wherever you are this afternoon to get up with us and stretch them out. We'll go to the bottom of seven. Quebec leads at 3-2 on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Do you have a plan to escape winter this year? How about an Air Canada vacations trip with endless sunny skies, pristine white sand beaches, warm turquoise water, friendly people, zesty food, and music that really gets you moving. Plan the perfect escape this winter to the Grand Bahia Principe all-inclusive resort with Air Canada Vacations. Direct flight from Winnipeg to Montego Bay, Jamaica all winter long. Start planning your getaway today at aircanadavacations.com. I'll take a nip, and don't you forget those grilled onions. You know what I love? Breakfast all day. Bring on the Sal's hearty breakfast. I love seeing what's new. Barbecue, chicken nip, yes please. Salisbury House, a Winnipeg tradition for more than eight decades. From all-day breakfast, traditional dinners, and classic nips made with 100% Manitoba beef, to salads, wraps, and more. And who could forget wafer pie and red velvet cake for dessert? It's all available all the time. Salisbury House, your house, your food, your way. Swung on high, and deep it goes to left. Way back. Goal! Get your Gold Eyes tickets before they're gone. Gold Eyes season tickets, nine game mini packs, and Sky Suites are on sale now. Celebrate the Gold Eyes 20th season and cheer on the 2012 American Association champions. Oh, my. 
Get your seat for the repeat. Call 982 BASE. Bottom of the seventh inning. Nate Sampson, Nick Lyles, and Jordan Guida. 3 2 Quebec in front. First pitch to Sampson. Swung on. That's hit high. Out to left field, but not very deep. And and Sigley will be there to make the catch in advance of the warning track. And there's one down on one pitch. And the batter is Nick Lyles. An ominous looking cloud is rolling in from behind us. And let's just hope that it holds off as we're getting fairly late into this one. By the way, Cleveland defeated Washington in a couple of Major League Baseball finals on the end of town scoreboard. Manitoba Blue Cross, 2-0 the final for the Indians over the Nationals. First pitch is inside to Lyles, ball one. Corey Kluber, the win, 5-4. Steven Strasburg, the loss, 3-6. Vinny Pistano, his first save, pitches in there for a strike. It's 1-1. One and, one. and Miami defeated St. Louis today, 7-2. Pitch. Is outside two and one. Ricky Nolasco four and seven with the win. Tyler Lyons the loss. And Cincinnati got by Milwaukee five to one. Johnny Cueto is fourth win to go to four and zero. Oh. Pitch is swung on, bounced over towards second. Up with it Willoughby and on to first base. Two away for Jordan Guida. And Fargo's leading Gary nine three in the seventh in that one game other than this one that started around one o'clock in the American Association. Here's Guy to one for two today. And Guy to stands in from the right hand side. First pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. A lefty getting loose in the bullpen now for Quebec. And it's number 13 in Casey Harmon. The pitch is a little bit low, one and one. Just to finish off, when the Gold Eyes get back home here on Thursday, there's that Jamaica trip that you can win. One, one. Ricky Ball on the outside edge for a strike. Friday, June 21st, pancake batter later this coming week. Party on the patio deck on Saturday. And the pitch is swung on, bounced out towards short. To his left, helped, up with it, on to first. And it is in time to get Jordan Guy to the Gold Eyes go one, two, three. So check out the Gold Eyes website, goldeyes.com, for more information. And tickets 5, 7, 12, 14, and $18. As always, you can get them at the door on the phone, online. Ticketmaster.ca is online, of course, and on the phone, 855 Gold Eyes. We'll go to the eighth inning, 3 2 Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Now, more than ever, Metro Center gets you where you need to go. Winnipeg Store for All Things Trailer now offers Air Miles Reward Miles and truck accessories. So, whenever you come to Metro Center for trailers, parts, hitches, and more, you can also earn Air Miles Reward Miles. Get where you need to go with over 4,000 square feet of trailer parts, truck accessories, online ordering, knowledgeable staff, and trailer service at your Winnipeg Trailer Store. Metro Center 620 Dan. Visit metrotrailers.ca. Ah, nice day. Want a drink? Yeah. Pass me a Pepsi. How you doing? Whoa. Do you hear that? Open your Pepsi. How you doing? That was awesome. Hit it out of the park this summer. How you doing? With the cool, refreshing taste of Pepsi. Pepsi. Live for now. The Winnipeg Gold Eyes make dreams come true by providing live baseball experiences to charities, nonprofit groups, and inner city programs. Now, with the Gold Eyes Community Zone, you can make even more memories. For group tickets, contact the Gold Eyes at 982 Base. These extra seats are only possible through generous donations from the Community Zone partners. So, from the Winnipeg Gold Eyes and Community Zone recipients, thank you. Boston Pizza, Labatt, Manitoba, Boeing Canada, and Dairy Farmers of Manitoba. The stats, the stories, and every swing for the fences. It's Gold Eyes Baseball on TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Well, we go to the eighth inning, and leading off is Carlos Willoughby. 
Number nine batter in the order. It's Willoughby Helps and Mallow against Matt Raj. 3-2 Quebec. First pitch of the eighth is outside. Ball one. Willoughby 0 for 2 today. They do have that left-hander in Casey Harmon warming up in that bullpen for Quebec. The 1-0. Swung on. Bounce right side and into the seats it goes. One ball, one strike. Have a look at the answer on trivia here. In this eighth inning, pass along the winner's name as well. One ball, one strike. The pitch to Willoughby is a little bit low, two and one. He has bounced out and struck out. Matt Rush has retired ten in a row. Two balls and one strike to the switch hitting second baseman for Quebec. 2-1 is outside. Three balls and one strike. Ball trivia is always brought to you by the Place Louis Riel Suite Hotel in downtown Winnipeg. Place Louis Riel specializing in spacious executive suites. The 3-1. Swung on. Popped up. Right side of the infield. Harthers there along the line. And he and Lyles just about collide. Who caught it? Who caught the baseball? It's going to be Casey Harther that did. And Harther and Lyles discuss it a little bit, but Casey stayed with it. And the first baseman made the catch, straddling the right field line just slightly behind his bag. And Harther came in behind him. Excuse me, Lyles came in behind him. And that could have been disaster. Anyway, Harther makes the squeeze. One down. Jeff Helps is 0 for 3. He'll step in from the left side. Matt Rush operating from the full line. First pitch is inside, ball one. Question today was this. On three occasions last season, a Winnipeg Gold Eyes pitcher was named the American Association Pitcher of the Week. 1-0 is on the outside edge for a strike. I wanted to know who were they. I wanted you to name them. And it was Super Stumper Sunday. Pitches in there for a strike, and it's one and two to Helps. Congratulations today to Ryan Karpoff of North Kildonan. Good for you, Ryan. The one two pitch is just outside two and two. And Ryan Karpoff knew the answer to be Ace Walker and Matt Rush twice, two two. Swing and a miss and helps down on strikes. Went after a fastball outside the zone. Chased it. Strikeout number six for Matt Rush. Two away for Jonathan Mello. Who has doubled and scored. And hit a home run and then flew out his last trip. Yeah, Ace Walker was the pitcher of the week last year, June 3rd. Then Rush followed the week after, June 10th. And then Matt Rush was the final pitcher of the week in the American Association for the week of September 2nd. First pitch is low, ball one. So, yeah, there was three pitcher of the week honors to Gold Eyes, but Matt Rush won two of them and Ace Walker the other. Congratulations to Ryan Karpoff of North Kildonan today. 1-0 is in there for a strike, one and one. And Ryan picks up a pair of gold eye tickets to a future home game, is also eligible to win the grand prize of a weekend stay at the Place Louis at the end of the season. The 1 1 is low, two balls and one strike. And we'll do it again tomorrow night from St. Paul, Minnesota. Another final in the majors today is we get a right hander up and throwing in the bullpen for Winnipeg. It's Patrick Keating. New York Mets beat the Chicago Cubs 4-3. Comeback win. The pitch. Breaking ball on the corner for a strike. 2-2. Two two. Bobby Parnell picked up the win to go to 5-3. Carlos Marmol took the loss. 2-4. Mets scored 4 in the ninth. To win it. 2-2. Two two. Is high. Three balls and two strikes. And Marmol gave up a home run to Kurt Neuenheis. A three-run jack that walked the Mets off in victory over the Cubbies today. The payoff pitch. 
Swung on, fouled away right side. And that will get into the seats. Three balls, two strikes. Three and two. Two away in the inning. Jonathan Mallow is two for three today, a right-handed batter. And the payoff pitch. Swung on, bounced out toward third. A nice scoop there by the other third baseman in the game. And Ramon fires a strike across. And Mallow is retired. Good D there by Famous Amos. Maybe that's what's made Amos famous on the ball diamond. Three up, three down. We go to the bottom of eight. Three to Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Do you know where all your food comes from? from eating local is easy at the carver's knife all of the meat they sell comes from local manitoba meat producers tender aged beef quality pork and chicken the carver's knife offers the finest meat products manitoba has to offer because quality matters it has to be the carver's knife supporting local farmers 1530 regent avenue west and 39 marion street in the dominion center mall Cal Tire, the tire and wheel experts, with the best selection of tires and wheels in the industry, and all at prices that can't be beat. In fact, if you find a lower advertised price, even from Costco, take it in and Cal Tire will match it or even beat it. Spring is the time to pay attention to your vehicle, so take it to the most knowledgeable in the industry. It's time to talk to Cal at any of Cal Tire's five convenient Winnipeg locations. You gotta roll with me. It's furniture that has a story to tell. Discover the unrivaled character and craftsmanship only Manitoba Made can offer with Prairie Barnwood. Prairie Barnwood specializes in handcrafted furniture and decor made from dismantled barns from across the Canadian prairies. From mantles to countertops, furniture, even custom pieces, it's all made in Manitoba. See these one-of-a-kind works of art for yourself. Learn more about Manitoba reclaimed barnwood furniture today at prairiebarnwood.com. Bottom of the eighth inning, and a new pitcher for Quebec, Casey Harmon, comes in. And he'll spell off Dustin Crenshaw, who leaves as the pitcher of record on a winning side. For Crenshaw, seven innings, five hits, two runs. They're both earned today. A walk, two strikeouts. And he stands to pick up his fifth win, and the bullpen now can hold it for La Capitale. 3-2 Quebec in front, top of the order for Winnipeg, Graham Ramon and Mazzola against Harmon, who works for his second straight night. We saw him last night, an inning and one-third, two hits, no runs, no walks, no strikeouts. He did balk a couple of runners to second and third, but no damage done. And the lefty will face Tyler Graham, first pitch is in there for a strike. This pitching change brought to you by Johnson Waste Management. Or 5-2-0-9-0-9. You know one. Swung on, followed away right side. And out of play. Casey Harmon, 6-1-2-10. 24 years old. And was in double A last year. In Tennessee. Nothing and two to Graham. Pitch is just inside, one and two. Graham one for two today with a walk. Patrick Keating continues to throw in the bullpen. The one, two is low, two and two, which tells me that he'll come out work the ninth. Matt Rush has done as well. Rush works through eight. Crenshaw through seven. Two, two. Swung on, chopper out towards short, helps is there, fields it, and throws to first, and one away. And the batter, Amos Ramon. Tomorrow, Mark Hardy, a lefty for Winnipeg, three and one with a 239 ERA against a fellow lefty, Cole Nelson, two and one with a 178. And that's in St. Paul tomorrow. First pitch to Ramon. It was right down the middle for a strike. 
5,881 here today. 58-81 on Dad's Day, the 01. Is half a swing. Did he go? The appeal and no, says Michael Leary over at first. And I'd like to say happy Father's Day to all the dads, including my father today. The 1-1. One -one. Swung on, bounced left side, foul ball. 1-2. and two. Also to my father-in-law. I've actually got two of them. Both by marriage. One ball, two strikes. The pitch. Swung on, a comebacker, fielded by Harmon nicely at the side of the mound, and the pitcher then will throw to first to get Amos Ramon, and there'll be two away for Josh Mazzola. And Mazzola, 0 for 3. And Josh, I would think, is struggling a little bit. He's 1 for 11 in this series and three for 17 on the homestand but as I mentioned yesterday it only takes one swing and boy he hit left-handers real well last year he did not get to Herman last night though first pitch swung on and missed he's late with that swing and Mazzola batting 304 coming in three homers and 12 driven in the pitch swung on hit high not very deep. Right field, Awesome Shaw now backs up, and it's still carrying a little bit with the wind, and Shaw will make the catch, and that's it for Mazzola in the bottom of the eighth. Gold eyes go one, two, three. Nice, neat, and tidy inning for Casey Harmon. We go to the ninth, three, two, Quebec on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Did you know that water makes up more than half of your body weight? Every cell, tissue, and organ in your body needs water to maintain its temperature, remove waste, and lubricate joints. Culligan's filtered bottled water delivered right to your door is the best choice for hydration. Call or click today to find out how you can win tickets to a Winnipeg Gold Eyes game. We're giving away a pair every week. Just call 204-694-5180 or visit drinkculligan.com. Culligan, better water, pure and simple. Limited time offer. Dealer participation may vary. See dealer for details. In the competitive world of aluminum fishing boats, the bar has been raised again. Introducing the new Aluminum Kingfisher Revolution with exclusive pre-flex haul technology that delivers super strong construction, increased performance, and load handling without extra weight. It's the perfect combination for the weekend angler or fishing fanatic. Discover these revolutionary boats at kingfisherboats.com or give Girton Equipment a call at 1-800-619-0614. Kingfisher, fish the good times. Win a diamond at the diamond presented by free jive winnipeg and bijou jewelry pick up your special edition free jive paper at the tuesday july 2nd gold eyes game fill out the entry form and drop it in the ballot box for your chance to win a loose diamond worth more than twenty five hundred dollars free jive winnipeg online on site on the street delivered to hundreds of restaurants and thousands of inboxes every week for advertising info visit freejivewinnipeg.com brought to you by itech lasik boston pizza and herzing college you're listening to Gold Eyes Baseball on TSN 1290, tsn1290.ca. Brought to you in part by South Beach Casino. Like it, love it. Well, we go to the ninth inning, and a new pitcher for the Gold Eyes is Patrick Keating. 3-2 Quebec leads it. It's Boucher, Lavret, and Pelé. It is 3, 4, and 5. Patrick Keating. And Patrick Keating will step in from the left-hand side. Matt Rush has done eight innings, five hits, three runs, all earned. Two walks, six strikeouts, a real good bounce-back start today. Although he's on the hook for the loss as the Gold Eyes are on the wrong end of a 3-2 score right now. Boucher steps in from the left side, one for two, a walk, and RBI is stolen base and a run scored. First pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. And the ninth is underway this afternoon in Winnipeg. Mm -hmm. 
This pitching change brought to you by Johnson Waste Management, 4520909. You'll want change up is high. One ball, one strike. And for Patrick Keating, we see him for the second time in this series. He pitched on Friday night, did not get the save because the Gold Eyes won 6 0. 1 1. Curve a little bit high, 2 and 1. 1 inning, he was perfect. And for Patrick, he comes in and makes appearance number 13. He's 2-0 and with a 0-7-7 ERA. From the stretch, the 2-1. Fastball swung on, sliced down the left field line. Foul. And boy, got into those seats real quick over there. Everybody all right? somebody took a baseball off an appendage there. 2-2 two -two pitch. Curve swung on and that's over the mound. Out towards second. Picked up by Lyles. He quickly throws to first and they get the out of Boucher. Yeah, a little high chopper over the mound on the right side. Keating missed it. Lyles came in and made the play, and he had to hurry. Boucher scampered down that line pretty good. One down. And Randy Lebrett, the batter, he's one for three. And Lebrett will step in from the right-hand side. Keating comes set, first pitch. Curve is outside, ball one. Lebrett, one for three today. Patrick Keating, a right-hander. The Lions are looking to throw up a zero, zero here and then maybe try to walk it off again. Pitch is hit down the right field line. It is a fair ball and into the corner it goes and after it goes Mazzola. He'll pick it up and fire it towards second base. A relay is not in time. Nick Lyles took that cutoff and relayed it to second and Renny Lavrat for a big man moves pretty good and he has a one-out double on Keating here and here's Josue Pelly. By the way, Christian Guerrero's hit a bases clearing double. And the Railcats now lead 11-9 in the seventh inning over the fargo Red Redhawks. It's an eight-run inning for the Railcats. Here's Pelly. Only trying to drum up some support here. First pitch. Swung on and fouled back over my head for strike one. Pelle one for three today. Just a reminder, Sells win a winnie when the Gold Eyes win following any home game this season. Fans, when you take your game ticket to any of the Sells Express locations to receive a free winnie with the purchase of fries to be deemed, redeemed in the first seven days after the game. Pitch is in there for a strike. It's nothing in two. And that's courtesy of Salisbury House. Offer is not valid at Shop Park. One offer per ticket per season per visit. Sells win a Winnie Dog promotion when the Gold Eyes win at home. Nothing in two to Josue Pelly with one out and the runner at second. The pitch. Curve swung on. Lifted out toward right. Here comes Mazzola. He'll make the catch. And they'll be two away. And Royce can signally the batter. Consigli is 0 for 3 today, 0 for 5 in the series. But he has seven home runs and 21 driven in for Quebec. First pitch. Fastball on the outside edge for a strike. Consigli has struck out today and flown out twice, to center and to right. With two away, we look ahead 
to the bottom of nine. It's Harther, Davis, and Lentini, heart of the order. 0-1. Swung on, popped up. Shallow center. Back goes Sampson. In comes Graham. Graham calls off the shortstop, and the center fielder makes the catch. And that is that for Quebec in the ninth. No runs, a double, one left. We'll go to the bottom of nine. Last chance for the Gold Eyes coming up. Arthur, Davis, and Lentini, heart of the order. They need one to tie, two to win it. We'll see what happens when we return. Make sure you do from downtown on the Gold Eyes radio network. Right now, you don't care that money problems can happen to anyone. You don't want to hear people telling you they understand what you're going through. You don't want words. You want a way forward, out of your debt, so your creditors stop calling. L.C. Taylor is your debt rescue, helping you build a plan to climb back onto solid financial ground. You can do it. You just need a helping hand. So take ours. L.C. Taylor, trustees in bankruptcy. Your way forward at lctaylor.com. You like to shop around and ask, Is that the best you can do? So do we. When it comes to windows, Best Windows and Doors doesn't go with just a single manufacturer. We shop around. Only the best quality, efficiency, and warranty will do. And only a few have it all. And that's all you'll find at Best Windows. So go ahead, shop around and ask, Is that the best you can do? No doubt you'll find your way to Best Windows and Doors, where the best is all we do. 1676 St. James. Dads aren't complicated. They like food, they like cars, and they like spending quality time with their kids. And this weekend, the Pony Corral can help you out with all of those. Celebrate Father's Day with all your friends at the Pony. Delicious breakfast, lunch, and dinner menus will have Dad's mouth watering. And then make sure to stick around for the hottest rides in the city with the Sunday Night Cruise Car Show at the Pony on Grant. Show Dad a great time this Father's Day with the Pony Corral. Proudly celebrating 25 years. Well, we go to the bottom of the ninth inning, and the closer is on for Quebec. Chris Cox had been warming in that top half of this eight, ninth inning, excuse me, top half of nine. We go to the bottom of nine, 3 2 Quebec. It's Arthur Davis, the DH, and Lantini to face the third pitcher of the afternoon in Chris Cox. Casey Harmon is done, and he went one inning for Quebec. No runs, no hits, no walks, and no strikeouts. Pitching change is brought to you by Johnson Waste Management. 4-5-2-0-9-0-9. Casey Harther 0 for 3 today and 2 for 11 in the series. He'll face the right-hander in Cox who makes his 13th appearance and is 0-1 with a 3.65 ERA. First pitch. Fastball swung on, fouled away right side and out onto Pioneer Avenue. Watch out, you cabbies. Strike one. 12 and one-third innings for Cox. Nine hits, five earned runs. Just one walk, 15 strikeouts. The 0-1 swung on and fell back as Harther was right on top of that. Nothing to do. He's allowed two homers, the opposition batting 200 against him. Nothing in two to Harther. The pitch is a breaking ball that's outside. One and two. Chris Cox, again, we saw him last night. One inning, one hit, three strikeouts. No runs, no walks. One-two pitch. Breaking ball swung on and softly lined out to second, caught by Willoughby. One away. Gold eyes are down to their final two outs, and here's Leonard Davis, the DH. Chris Cox is listed as a rookie on this team and he's closing games. And Leonard Davis stands in from the left side. First pitch is on the outside edge for a strike. Davis is 0 for 3 today. And 2 for 10 in the series. Pitch swung on, foul back. And it's nothing in two. Nothing in two to Davis. Quickly in a hole here. The pitch. Swung on, fouled away left side. 
and out of play. You know, I know Leonard has been struggling. He is two for 21 on the homestand. But a home run threat, no less. The pitch, breaking ball, just missed outside. Whoa, that looks real good. One ball, two strikes. And the pitch, swung on and fouled to the plate. Davis stays alive. Old eyes don't win this. They would fall to one game above 500 and then look for some help in the out-of-town scoreboard from Wichita again and from Gary, who are leading Fargo right now down the road in North Dakota. One ball and two strikes. Davis has struck out and bounced out twice. The one two. Swung on, fouled to the plate. We do it again. 5,881 here today. Culligan in game line scored three runs, six hits for Quebec. Two and five. Four Winnipeg. One two pitch. Inside and got away from the catcher. Pelly goes back toward the screen. Should be two and two. And it is. Two balls and two strikes. And the pitch is inside, and Davis skipped out of the way of that. Three and two. Again, Cox hasn't walked many. Just one. Pretty tough to get a free pass off him. He hasn't hit a batter either. The payoff. Swung on and chopper foul again by Davis. Right side. Tell you what, though, it real good plate appearance here for Leonard Davis. You just hope that he finishes it off and gets on any way he can. Three balls, two strikes. The payoff. Breaking ball swung on and lined to the gap in right center. That's going to get down over to pick it up is Boucher. He slides, missed the baseball, trotting for second now is Davis, and he'll be in there standing. Oh, Leonard, how you doing? Great at bat, brother. And here is Phelan Lentini. That is a fantastic at bat in the bottom of the ninth inning here. He hacked pitches off, he fouled pitches, he skipped out of the way of the ones in the dirt, and then got what he could handle and lined it right to the gap in right center. And the Gold Eyes have the potential tied run into scoring position here in the bottom of the ninth inning, trailing 3-2. And Lantini won for three here today. Cox will come set, first pitch is low, ball one. One ball, no strikes. Lentini in the series is six for 10. The 1-0 -oh is in there for a strike and it's one and one. Fans didn't like that, neither did Lentini on the kind of late cold strike by Thomas Perko and it's one and one. One ball, one strike. Cox comes set, the 1-1 one, one pitch. Breaking ball, swung on, bounce right back up the middle. That's going to get by help. They're going to wave in Davis. Up with the ball, Boucher. And no throw home. Phelan Lantini's done it with an RBI single. Leonard Davis scores, and we are tied at three in the bottom of the nine. Baby! 
RBI single by Lantini, his second hit of the afternoon. And Chris Cox will blow the save here in the last of the ninth. And Nate Sampson, the batter, although they're going to pinch hit for him and bring in El Cabong. Nate Sampson is going to be taken out of the game, and Luis Allen will be brought in to pinch hit. One out, one in, one on. We're tied at three. Lantini's 14th run batted in. His seventh hit in 11 trips in this series. A little roller back through the middle that got by helps it into center. And here is Luis Allen. And the first throw goes over to first base and Lentini back in in time. Luis Allen got the day off to start, but picks up a bat to pinch hit. First pitch is a little bit high, ball one. Louis was one for four last night and is one for seven in the series. He has been struggling as well. He is two for 16 on the homestand. The pitch is high, two and oh, from Chris Cox. Two balls and no strikes. We're tied at three. The pitch on the outside edge for a strike. Luis Allen batting 298. Does not have a home run. He's had two doubles this year and he's driven in six. And a throw goes over to first, and it got dropped there by LeBret. He didn't know where it was. Get it up and take it off for second is Lentini. And he'll be there without a throw. That'll be an error, likely on the first baseman, E3. And that's the way they score it. And now a base hit with Lentini speed maybe wins this baby. Two balls and one strike, and now they're going to walk Luis Allen to face Nick Lyles and try to hope for a double play with one away and let the booing commence. And the 2-1 missed outside. The 3-1 did as well, and now it's a walk to Allen. And that is only the second walk issued by Quebec pitching today. And now T.J. Stanton. The former gold eye and former Red Hawk reliever, closer, and pitching coach now with Quebec comes out to have a little chat here. As Nick Lyles do up. Lyles, a double today, one for three. Gold eyes have tied it on a Davis double, a Lentini RBI single. And we're locked at three. And Nick Lyles stepping in from the right side after the mound meeting. Lyles has bounced out twice and doubled today. Lentini's the winning run with one out and two on. He's at second. First pitch is right down the middle for a strike. If you're wondering, Chris Cox has thrown two wild pitches this year. One ball, no strikes. And the pitch is high, one and one. Nick Lyles is three for 10 in this series. No homers and he's driven in four. The one one runner on the move from second to third pitches in there for a strike. And it's one and two, but more importantly, Lentini takes third base without a throw. So now a sack fly 
could do it if Lyles can put one in the air here. A ball and two strikes. The pitch swung on and fouled away. That's exactly what he's trying to do. Get one in the air to the outfield. One ball, two strikes. Again, the two wild pitches thrown by Cox. Another one here might win it for Winnipeg. One ball, two strikes. The pitch. Fastball swung on, bounced out towards third. Here comes Mello home the slide, and Latini is safe. Gold Eyes win it in a walk-off in the bottom of the ninth inning. Quebec did not play the infield in. A bouncer left side, Mallow came in and threw home. It was bang, bang, and the Gold Eyes get the call at home. Latini with his left foot in safely, and Winnipeg scores twice in the bottom of the ninth to win it. Four to three here, win the series, and their 1,000th career victory as a franchise. How about that in dramatic fashion here on a Sunday afternoon in downtown Winnipeg? Fish win, fish win, fish win their 1,000th this afternoon. And they do with two big runs in the bottom of the ninth. The final score, Winnipeg four, Quebec three, totals, and the post game are next after these on the Gold Eyes Radio Network. Hey, it's Ken, and there's a lot of ground to cover out here on the farm. You gotta stay connected. I'll tell you what Ken would do. Ken would keep a two-way radio all through the day. Very mobile as the Kenwood two-way radios that'll keep you talking. Tough, long-range, long battery life, and even hands-free. Two-way radios from Kenwood. It's what Ken would do, and you should too. After the sale, it's the service that counts. Prairie Mobile, your Kenwood authorized dealer. Swung on high, and deep it goes to left. Way back. Gone! Get your Gold Eyes tickets before they're gone. Gold Eyes season tickets, nine game mini packs, and Sky Suites are on sale now. Celebrate the Gold Eyes 20th season and cheer on the 2012 American Association champions. Oh, my. your seat for the repeat call 982 base like it love it south beach casino and resort is taking certain